Hello, this is Matt Moss 4848 here. Okay, today in this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you how to make a cool header for your website. Okay, so this header will look something like this. Okay, so first of all, what you need to do is open up Adobe Photoshop. It doesn't matter what um, version it is. Okay, so you need to go to File and New. And you need to do Preset Custom. Make sure the width is 780 pixels and the height is 120. You don't need to give it a name at the moment. Okay, click OK. And use the brush tool. Okay, now you can select a random colour over here. Okay, just um, draw randomly uh, like this and repeat this with several different colours. By the way, I didn't um, think of this idea from another tutorial, I thought of it completely by myself. Okay, this will look really good if you add some green to it. Okay, so now um, what you need to do is press filter in the menu bar, go to artistic and plastic wrap, and put the detail to maximum. Or if it looks a bit funny, you take it a bit lower than maximum. This looks perfectly okay. And now you need to click OK. You need to click Layer in the menu bar, go to New and Layer. You don't need to, you don't need to give this um, layer a name, but set the opacity to about 40%. Okay, now you need to... Um, select the gradient tool over here. If you can't see the gradient tool you need to right click on the paint bucket tool and click on gradient tool. Over here you'll see um, some colours put together. You need to click on that and click on the one called spectrum which is in the bottom left. Okay, I've already got that selected. Okay, what you need to do now is click on one edge of the image or header and drag it, drag the mouse um, to the other edge of it. Okay, now you'll see that um, the gradient that you can see the gradient, except um, it is 40% opacity. If you want, you can change it over here. Okay, we'll leave it at 35. Okay, now, if you want, you can go to Filter, Render, and Lens Flare. And you can put a lens flare anywhere in the image. I like to put the lens flare in the top right of the image and make the brightness about, uh, about 117%. And leave it at... 50 to 300 millimeter zoom. If you press enter now, and you'll see that it is fairly bright over here. Okay, if your image is transparent and you want the background to be white, what you need to do is go to layer, new layer, and don't change the color. Drag it to the bottom. And what you need to do now is use the pencil to draw really thick and make sure you've selected white in this. Okay, this might um, change colour but not be completely white because of the gradient. Okay, thanks for watching this tutorial. Please subscribe um, to me. Check out my other tutorials and rate and comment this video.